what the hell? What's going on, everyone? We are back with some more JoJo's. The last episode, we did see the death of Baron. R.I.P. to that man. Great ass dude, and he was just genuine. You know, he had one task on mind, and he was doing whatever it took to achieve it. And now he passed the torch to Jonathan, and he's working with his boys, Dyer, Strazio, and the Hamon master himself, Tom Petty, which I'm excited to see what he cooks up. And now it looks like we are just going towards the final boss in Dio. So let's just see what happens in this episode. Oh, he's getting sco- Oh, shit. Dad's not playing with him. Got smacked right away. Oh my goodness. It's all because of him. Honestly, one thing I do wish, I just hope nothing happens to his sister because that's going to haunt him for the rest of his life. Alright, Dio, what do you want from him? Oh, hell no. If I saw that on the street, it is getting punted. I am sorry. That shit is disturbing. Oh, okay. Spin some game on her. Damn. That, what is that word? Sweet 600 yo. Fuck no. <laughs> Fuck that dog, bruh. Fucking creep. Oh. Oh! Fuck. <laughs> that bastard did deserve that. I'm not gonna lie, after the whole thing with Arena. My man can't stand another rejection. If she rejects him, oh, he is going to lose it. Or maybe he matured up. Oh, damn. She does not care whatsoever. <laughs> she really be standing on business, though. Ooh, what? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. This motherfucker drooling on her. My companion. Oh my god, this is like a Greek god. Who the fuck is this guy? Dreaded Doobie. Why has he got such like a... Like a little boy ass name, but he's so huge, bro. Goofy ass name for that? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh! Where the hell did that anvil come from? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, okay, it's Jonathan. And I, honestly, they pulled up way quicker than I would have thought, but god damn, way toss at you, Jonathan. <laughs> All right, Jonathan time. Let's go, baby. Oh, snakes. What the hell? Yeah, that's got to be some poison too, maybe. Yeah. Uh. Is he like Medusa? What the fuck is going on? <laughs> These two are both panicking. Look at the twitches from the eyebrow. Oh shit, even one coming out of his eye. Yare, <laughs> yare. Oh, wait, it's cool, ass. There's something light for him. Give me those. Just like how he did the tongue. Oh, he got the poison out. Nice. Oh, with the Hamon fire. Yes, sir. Shout out to Baron. The goat. Damn. Oh. Right back at you. Wow. The... Like, seeing Jonathan improve this drastically is insane. 
He is a natural learner. Is this Dio's? Oh. It is time. It is Dio's lair. Dio. <laughs> I've been waiting for this showdown. Shit was light. Eh, actually, no, it was not light. Never mind. Tarkus was a problem. Man, just fucking run the ones. Fuck the goons. Let's go. Finally. You got to stay on business yourself. Okay, bro. Chill with the friendly banter, bro. You know you do not fuck with him. I don't know if he's still trying to manipulate him or what. A hint of hesitation. Okay. Oh my. Okay, hold on. I don't know. Like. The animation has changed drastically. Like, Jonathan and Dio with these, like, close-up shots, they look phenomenal. Finally. I like this out, Jonathan. No hesitation. Yep. Do it for Baron. I love the way he says Jojo when he's getting like hyped up. <laughs> oh. Shit, dire. He running it. Oh yeah, that was his boy of like 20 years plus, I think, right? Yeah. They were like sparring partners. Oh, whoa, whoa. Hold on, Dyer. He kind of cool with it. Slow on air. Yeah, he was moving like slow motion. I remember that. Wow. Oh, yeah, the slow mo kick. Hey, do the splits real quick. Widen those legs. <laughs> hey, fuck it, yo. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Damn. Ah, those arms are good. Oh, oh my god, it's his whole body. GG's. He's done for. Okay, wow. Dyer's out of this fight. Holy shit. He got him in this crazy position. <laughs> he turned that man to a statue. Damn. I can't even lie. Dio is a great villain. I gotta give him his props. <laughs> what is he? Oh my goodness. Wow, he just met him too. That's gotta hurt. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh shit, in the eye. Still got some fight in him. Oh, a dire for at most two minutes. That is fucking crazy. Like, wow, you inter you give us a great introduction to Dyer and he just died that quick. Damn, man. At least he did his special move before he went out with a bang and sent that rose. Come on, Jonathan. It's all up to you. Oh, the blade! From Blueford. It says pluck on it. Come on. Okay. Let's go. He's got the luck. 
Oh, he feeling some type of way. <laughs> oh, Dio's about to crash. Oh my gosh, not the fucking zombie horde, bro. Now they have to deal with this bullshit first. Oh yeah, the Hamon. It takes effect in your face super well. I forgot about that. That's what I'm thinking, too. I do think Jonathan could put up a good fight, but in all, I think Dio takes it. Ooh. Okay. A little stalemate. Okay. Oh, his eyes. A little swollen. Oh, some more of the roses. <laughs> Who knew Dio's biggest op would be a rose? Yeah, JoJo's got the experience. Oh my goodness! There's a screech. <laughs> oh my... Yo, no. Jo Jonathan. Wait, that was like a little too easy though. There's no way. Yeah, I was about to say. Oh my god. Oh, right into his neck. Fucking hell, bro. That bullshit freeze technique is just so broken. Oh my god, he's like finger in his vein. Ugh. Shit, shit crazy. Ooh. Oh, GG's. Oh, GG's. Not like this, man. He got him literally stun locked. He can't move. Why is he playing with his vein like that? Uh-oh. Uh Speedwagon. God damn it. He can't even do nothing about that. Wait. Jonathan? What you got? Wait, he took some precautionary measures. He was expecting the ice. Wow. Jonathan really got that battle IQ. Oh! Big hand! Oh! Straight to that cheek. Oh, what? Oh, and he's just getting his arm back. So it looks like if you even touch Dio, you freezing up. Like, how can you even beat him then? <laughs> yeah, I was about to say. I could freeze your whole body. Into okay, realistically. I feel like Jonathan has... If you really look at it, he's done everything perfect. You know what I mean? It's just that ice counter is just so broken. How do you even, you know, pass by it? Mm. I think he uh, just fixed it, yeah. What the mom? Jonathan's a trooper. He's wanted this get back for a minute now. I guess same for Dio too. Oh, there's the one second clip right there. <laughs> Monkey cannot stand against a human. Alright, you've still got some hope in you. I like that. 
Ooh, he doing a little spin move with it. Okay. Got some fire mixed with it. So he could counteract the ice. Oh! 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 He pushed through! Straight to the chest. Wow. I'm gonna be honest. I... Uh, dude, this... I guess Dio is right. Jonathan always gets stronger as the fight continues. It just doesn't feel right though. I feel like Dio should be slamming him. Oh, that was a laser. Didn't that hit Jonathan though? Yeah, I was about to say. That was like the last second trump card right there. You know, isn't it crazy? Oh my god, he's crying. Hold on, let me hear what he says first. Or let me say this for four. Isn't it crazy that Dio whooped his ass one time? And then after that, Jonathan said, oh, I'm not losing anymore. I'm not letting that shit slide no more. He's really crying for him. I mean, at the end of the day, he was technically his brother for a minute. As much as they hated each other. I mean, Jonathan, he's just got a heart, man. A great heart. Even whenever they were playing rugby, there was still some connection there. Like, come on. Yeah, exactly. Ah, oh, man. Of course. Zeppeli was your brother. Wow. The MC did it. Jonathan. What did I say? A couple episodes ago, he's got that clutch gene in him. I'm gonna be a hundred percent on. I did not expect Jonathan to win this fight at all. The fact that he won is honestly beyond me. I like you went out sad three times. First, you were trying to pull out a knife on him. Second time, you were literally immortal, OP state, bulletproof, all of that. And he still put you on a stake and cooked you. And then third, he literally learned Hamon, mastered it, and cooked you. Dio. I'm not gonna lie, bro. You gotta get back somehow. I, I know that's not the end of you, but like, god damn, you might have to just blow up the world after that or some shit. Oh, <laughs> it's Dio falling. <laughs> Oh yeah, he got all the hormone in his brain. Oh what? He decapitated himself? Ooh, who is that? Oh, that's the medicine guy, I think. Oh yeah, he's a zombie now. A new body. What? All right, so Dio will be back, definitely. But for now, Jonathan Joestar is victorious. Oh, Speedwagon had the honors. Yes, sir. Oh, Erina! He really got his happy ending. He kept his word. I will be back to see Erina. I love how he wears Baron's hat all the time. 
He really is cherishing it. That's beautiful. Oh. <laughs> that dude's feet wagging is bugging. <laughs> oh my god. He just got ran over. Oh my goodness. The Asian medicine doctor, that's Dio in there. He's about to ruin this wholesome moment. That breathing. I know it from anywhere. Where? So, is that going on Jonathan and Erina's ship? Oh, look at those two. Great. I'll come running. Wow. But I do like Speedwagon and Jonathan's Bond. I mean, they're boys. Speedwagon's always there for him. Bon voyage. Don't tell me the cask. Oh my, of course the casket's gotta be on the ship. I'm getting the OG Baron vibes when the mask took control of everything. Oh, I feel like something bad's about to happen. Oh my goodness. Yo, everything is going a little too well. I'm just envisioning the worst. As much as I want to enjoy this, man. Wow, you got a way with words, Jonathan. That is literally poetry right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, my boy, George. Oh, damn. <laughs> He still got some clumsiness in him. My man just lost some aura. <laughs> aura points off of that, but it's cool. Oh, okay. They dressed up. Some wine. Won't hurt anyone. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my gosh. So he realized the Asian medicine guy, something's up. Oh, the PTSD. Flashbacks coming back to him. Oh. Oh. Shit. Oh no, they led Jonathan into this room. Got him the new body too. My man Jonathan can't catch a break. He was just chilling with his wife. Oh my goodness. That damn Asian medicine doctor, man. This guy Dio will never give up until Jonathan's dead. You have respect? Wow. That's the last thing I would think I would hear out of Dio. Him giving Jonathan props. That is true. Oh, he wants Jonathan's body. If he does that, man. Oh! Oh! That's direct contact to the neck. First, it was the frozen, 
ability ability not the lasers those are devious yeah that's enough I think oh she didn't go to the room she was trying to save him and she has to witness her husband in the state This motherfucker is relentless. The one that took your first kiss. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh! The zombies. Did he throw a fucking floaty at that dude's dome? <laughs> <laughs> oh, not the axe. Jeez. The baby's still alive, though, at least. Oh. I'm surprised this dude is still alive. I'm gonna be honest. This dude, Jonathan, is a tank. Uh, and now his dick riders doing the work for him. Fuck. Hey, you do a lot of meat riding for how he did your for your lord over there. I can't hold you. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I was, that's what I was saying. He got him looking like this. What? He still got fight in him? What's the finale looking like? Oh, you can't see the eyes. Anything to for Erina. Look, I'm on move. Ooh. Oh, that's GG's. No. Damn. Got him out the way. Dio lost his main henchman. Oh, that's why it was the title. Stop the ship. Steam inside the... Okay. Did I just hear that right? Okay, the piston... What? The piston will stop? Piston will keep building up the steam inside, causing the ship to explode. What? Okay, that that's some MC. That that, <laughs> that is crazy. You're telling me Jonathan's last move, what he did to Wang, took off his head, made him cling on to that shit for the ship to explode. <laughs> Everything ended up perfectly. <laughs> oh, here's the wholesome moment. Oh. This shit's so sad. They just got married. They're not just that. Oh, wow. Go out with him. And he got that kiss. Beautiful. There it goes. Still got some life in him. Oh, the baby. Oh, the baby's still alive. So. 
she's gonna live on and now she's gonna be the mother to this unknown baby true she caught a whole axe oh my god that is literally a full circle moment right there oh they reset him so Dio is really gonna get Jonathan's body uh oh. Uh. Oh. Oh my goodness. Jonathan was able to do that? In that state? Oh. Oh my goodness. It's over. Wow. He was ready for this. Uh. Oh! Damn! He just hugging him. He still got that fight in him. What? No, dude. No. Ah. He is hugging someone that was a brother to him and his biggest enemy. Oh, now you're trying to switch up. He's accepted it. Wow. Wow. 1889. 1889. What's the math on that? 18 he died when he was 29 years old, I think, is the math on that. Because it start, it started in eighteen seventy. He was a baby, so maybe like thirty. But I think he was like twenty nine, thirty, thirty one, something like that. Wow. Rest in peace, to Jonathan. What a good ass dude, man. Even at in the end of that fight with Dio, he had emotion towards him because he grew up with him he had that bond with him he, even as much hell he brought uh deal brought to him he still had love for him wow i think this is erin talking now yeah, he did a lot, man. He saved a lot of people from Dio. There's a coffin. Oh, this is Arana in there, then. With the baby. So, the story of Jonathan Joestar will live on. Through Aaron as well. Okay. A new adventure. Phantom Blood finished. Wow. Dude, that was such great closure to Phantom Blood. They, like, you know the saying, go out with a bang. They went out with a fucking bang. Wow. The book closed, closed for a time. They even got Danny in there, man. They even got Danny in there. Oh.
Okay. Amazing. So, Jojo, he took Dio with him. Era now has this baby with her. And I assume we are going to see the new life with Erina and that baby. Alright, it looks like next episode we probably will continue the story with Erina and the baby. We'll see more of that. But, yeah. These two episodes were phenomenal. You know, the fight with Dio and Jonathan. Whenever I thought it was wraps for Jonathan, he somehow pushed through it and came out on top. And then... Dio came back once again, tried to take Jonathan's body, kind of use him as a vessel almost. And don't get me wrong, if he got Jonathan's body right there, that would have been like the perfect case scenario. Jonathan is literally a juggernaut, a tank. That body withstood a lot of damage and he was still fighting through it. So yeah, if he was able to obtain that, Dio would have been unstoppable. I really did enjoy the little slice of life scenes with Erina and Jonathan. It's sad that it was so short just because of, you know, the altercation that happened. But what a beautiful story it was. I really do like how um, before when they were on the wagon, he's like, I have to see Erina once again. Which he did keep his word. And they got that like little wholesome moment. But of course, it came crashing down. Uh, yeah, nine episodes, Phantom Blood, finish. And now that I do think about it, I'm glad that I stopped watching JoJo's years back. Because I feel like I really wasn't picking up what JoJo's was playing down. Whenever I watched it right now, I feel like I really am obtaining the information. It's hitting me hard. And... Watching these last two episodes really just had me at all. Like, I enjoyed it so much. I can't wait to see what is to come from the show. I mean, now we have a new story. Phantom Blood. It really picked up crazy at the end. I can't wait to see more. I appreciate all of you guys for watching. I'll catch all of you in the next one. Peace out.